Hello, in this video, we will look at operator precedence and associativity in Java. Now, if you have already studied BODMAS in maths, you might remember seeing how it explains the order of operations to solve an expression. Similarly, in Java, when there are multiple operators in an expression, Java has well-defined rules for specifying the order in which operators are evaluated. Taking this expression as an example, will multiplication happen first or addition? When two operators share the same operand, the operator with higher precedence goes first. Here multiplication has higher precedence, so it will happen first. Let's see the precedence order in Java. The topmost precedence is of parenthesis. It is used to group expressions and it overrides everything else. Next is dot which is used in objects and brackets used for arrays. After that comes postfix increment and decrement operator followed by prefix and unary. Then is multiplication division followed by addition and subtraction. Then there are bitwise shift operators followed by relational operators and equality. Then there are bitwise AND, OR followed by logical AND and OR. Next is tertiary operator followed by various assignment operators. Along with precedence, Java also defines associativity. Associativity defines the grouping or order of evaluation when there are operators of same precedence. For example, here we have both multiplication and division. So which one will get executed first? Since associativity is left to right, first division is done and then multiplication. Now let's see some example questions that can be asked on this. You would be given an expression and you would be asked to evaluate as per precedence rules Let's take this as an example. Here multiplication and division has higher precedence, so those will be evaluated first. In cases where two operands have the same precedence, then it is evaluated as per associativity of left to right. To solve this, put the brackets first and then solve each precedence in separate line wherever possible. Once you have solved the multiplication and division, move to the next precedence of plus and minus which is also evaluated left to right as per the associativity rules. This gives us the answer. Let's take another example. If a is 12 and b is 8, find the value of c which is equal to plus plus 8 divided by 6 plus b plus plus modulo 3. Whenever there are unary operators, you need to be extra careful and at each step also record what is the value of operands after a particular operation. Let's start by first putting brackets on higher precedence. First is postfix. For this, we substitute the value of b and we record what is the final value of b separately after executing the operation. Next is prefix. Here too, we execute the prefix operator and record the value of A. Next is division and modulus followed by addition. Last is assignment where we assign the value to C. Do go through other examples that have been given on precedence and associativity before you move to the next topic.